Hey Equestrian Gamers, Coolie here and welcome back to another video. Today we are looking at the six special coded horses you can breed on Wild Horse Islands. Now this did take me quite a while to create this video simply because I wanted to have all the information first before going ahead with this video. So I have been keeping an eye on the Discord group Happy Acres, which is the Discord group for this game. And thankfully so many awesome people have been putting in a thread what type of horses you need to breed together to get the special outcomes. So I was scrolling through and I did find a whole list that Mr. Jingles created and it's perfect. So it does tell you what type of coat colored horses you need to get the special results. So starting off with the chocolate Palomino, I have one in the Frisian. So to get a chocolate Palomino horse, you need to breed a liver chestnut with a Palomino paint. And then you have the slight chance to be able to get a chocolate Palomino horse. Then you have the sooty buck skin. So again, I have one in the Frisian form. To breed this one, you need a buckskin coated horse bred with any dapple coat, so either dapple grey or dapple palomino. Third on the list is a black splash Ovro, I could be saying that incorrectly. I think out of all the special coats, this one is definitely my favourite. Now there are different ways to be able to breed this special coat. You can either breed a black Ovro with a leopard coat, black Ovro with a black Sabino, or a black Ovro with a black Pinto Frisian. So three different ways that you have the chance to be able to obtain this special coat here. Next up we have the first brindle. So this is the grey brindle coat and the pattern on the horse is so amazing. So with the grey brindle you need to breed a grueler with any grey horse. So this one here is an Appaloosa cross Frisian. These are really, really, really cool to look at. I'm not sure if I prefer the grey or the bay brindle, which I'll show you guys in a second. But I think they just have a really, really interesting coat colour to them. Another way you can breed the grey brindle is with a bay brindle cross any grey coated horse. The second brindle that you can breed is called the Bay Brindle. Absolutely stunning. I do like how the pattern of the horse stands out more on the bay compared to the grey. Hello, got your butt in the screen. <laughs> <laughs> that is my mum in the background. Say hi mum. Hi mum. No, no. <laughs> hi everybody. <laughs> Oh gosh, my mum is helping me with videos today. So to breed one of these guys, you need a bay coloured horse crossed with a chestnut rabicano. Or you can breed a bay coloured horse with a grueler. Or also if you have a grey brindle, which was the horse we just looked at, so this one way over there. You can also breed that one with any bay coloured coat to get the chance to get the bay brindle. And finally, we have this interesting looking boy. This coat colour is called the Grey Bay Shimra. Probably pronouncing that incorrectly, but look at it. Isn't that so different? 
it is so so different to every other coat color there is in game so to be able to breed this one you will need a black sabino and any dapple coat so either a dapple gray or a dapple palomino coated horse Alrighty guys, so that is all six of the special coated horses. Absolutely amazing. Such an awesome idea to bring in these coat colours. It gives you so many varieties because you can put these coat colours on any breed of horse. So as you may have noticed, I got a few more Frisian than any other breed they are actually the breed I'm concentrating the most on at the moment I am slowly breeding lots and lots of Frisians to get a variety of different coat colors for a future video but it will still be a while till that one comes out but I am working on it Alrighty guys, I shall leave this video here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.